Mr. President is doing his best, despite his age. But Mr. President, having realized that, is encouraging the younger ones to come after him. And that was why he signed the Not Too Young to Run bill into law. So, it means Mr. President is quite aware of the challenges and enormity of the job that requires a younger generation to drive. In any case, Nigeria and the world today is about the future. And who are those that own the future? It is the younger generation. Coming from the angle of uh, North and South divide, then let us be very fair and equitable. Then you look into the number of years North have held this position and the number of years South have held this position. If you add eight years to what South has had, and then looking at the North, then you know that there's injustice as far as that is concerned. We have referred to history, the role of play. Let me tell you that today, the role North Central is still playing is greater. We still hold, we still remain the pilot. If you call it a right, if you call it a privilege, you have every right to request that we produce the next president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. Let me equally use this opportunity to call on the citizens of Kogi State and Nigeria youths, our able-bodied men and women out there, to please be calm. Myself and yourselves are the victims of whatever we don't want in our society today. We did not inflict these injuries and harm on ourselves. We inherited it. We grew up to inherit this problem. But I am very optimistic that we can solve the problem. First, I am an advocate of uh, capacity and ability to serve. Nigeria today, we need somebody who has the capacity to serve the country. By the grace of God, ladies and gentlemen, the same day I have responded to the various calls for me to run for the presidency. In 2023, I will equally respond to you that I will not disappoint you. GYB is never a threat to anybody's hope and aspiration. Tell them that I am coming.